A slew of semi trucks stacked up in traffic for miles near the Otay Mesa port of entry. ABC 10 News reporter Ryan Hill is live in Otay Mesa with the reason for this backup tonight. Ryan. U.S. and Mexican officials are saying that a computer system failure on the Mexican side of the border is the culprit of that major congestion, but some drivers are saying that they didn't even want to bother with all of that traffic today. Plenty of big rig trucks looking like they're parked in Otay Mesa. It's the first time I've ever seen this. I come down here every week. But in reality, they're all waiting to cross through the port of entry. I've been here since 2 o'clock, and I, there ain't no getting over there. <laughs> there ain't no way. Some drivers, like Harry West, decided the traffic here wasn't worth the trouble. Wait till tomorrow morning and hope that line's down. This first time I've ever been late. I don't, I'm, I'm never late. I, mean, I take pride in being on time. And, and this, there's, there's no way of being on time. U.S. Customs and Border Protection, along with the president of Tijuana Customs Association, say a computer failure on the Mexican side of the border is causing the delays just for commercial traffic. Mexican Customs says when the system is down, agents have to do everything manually, write down information, in turn, setting wait times way back. They hope to have the system up and running by tomorrow. And there's hope from West that tomorrow moves faster and smoother. It slows everybody down, everything. I mean, not just us delivering, but picking everything up, coming back. I mean, I don't know how long it's going to take to get back across. A CBP spokesperson tells me that there was no impact to regular passenger traffic today. Reporting here in Otay Mesa, Ryan Hill, ABC 10 News. A tough day for those truckers. Thank you, Ryan.